Many are now asking, is this the summer of the shark? The great white, at least. We've been tracking them up and down the coast. And tonight, how scientists are now following them, the device they're using, and how far some of the sharks, Catherine included, have gone already. Here's ABC's Matt Gutman. It sure seems like a very sharky summer. Last week, this California swimmer chopped by a great white. And it's biting your chest and you're staring at it. The attacks, no coincidence. The number of great whites up 42% since 1997. More than 2,000 of the truck-sized fish now roaming the East Coast alone. The good news, we now know where a lot of them are. Thanks to GPS, scientists and fishermen tagging six of the apex predators just this weekend. And over the past year, millions online already tracking a 2,300 pounder named Catherine. From Cape Cod to Key West and nearly to Louisiana. Their comeback? thanks to an increase in their favorite food, seals. Thankfully, not humans. Swimming with sharks off the Bahamas, they learned some sharks actually crave affection, even the hug of a reporter. And David, in case you were wondering about Catherine the Great White, well, she's hooked a big old U-turn and is heading back to South Florida beaches like this one. And who knows, maybe at some point this summer, she could be headed to a beach near you.